Thanks, Jordan, for your quality <laughs> input going on over there. That was excellent. Yeah, yeah, I guess. I love when I'm in the studio. It's like the favorite, my favorite hour of my week is like putting that headset on. Once I decided that I wanted to do radio and I got into all this Cronkite classes and we started our podcast last September, I feel like we've just gotten to know each other. Like every single week we get to know each other a little bit more about what goes on and what makes us tick. And then, like, we're really nice to each other. We really like each other. But when we get in the studio, if we get, like, a chance to, like, shoot a jab in at someone or about something they said or something they posted on Instagram or Facebook or something, we'll just let them have it. And remember to like our page this Thursday or tell your friends if they share haven't liked it. Share it. Share know? it. There will be a post about it. Just share and it. And remember, yes. you're still not Ken Judd. True that. Beating that horse to death. <laughs> we can talk about that my bracket is totally busted. The only team I had right in the Final Four was Louisville. Thank you, University of Miami and uh, Kansas and U of A. He talks golf all the time, right? So I'm expecting, I'm expecting a lot out of the kid. No, no. It was bad. It was a train wreck. You know, it was, it was ugly. I started golfing when I was a kid. I took lessons here in the summer, and then uh, I played in high school my sophomore, junior, and senior season, and then now I just uh, play for fun. Just go out, have a couple beers, play with your friends, you know? Golf is an escape just because when you're out on the course, it's just like you, the course, your friends, you're drinking, you're smoking cigars, you're doing whatever. You don't have to worry about all that other stuff that's going on once you leave the course. My favorite part of golf, um, I would say making like a super long putt. The hardest part of golf is uh, forgetting about the last shot. A lot of times once you hit one bad shot, it's gonna lead you to hitting another bad shot and another bad shot. So the hardest part in golf, which I think relates to life in a way, is just when something bad happens, just get it out, of the, forget about it and move on.